October 31st, 2023, a run on today's schedule, and these are your morning announcements. Happy Halloween, Wheaton Knights! Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Want to keep this spooky fun going even after the holiday is over? Check out Wheaton's drama fall play, I Am Frankenstein, a new adaption of Mary Shelley's classic that started the entire science fiction genre on Friday, November 10th at 7 p.m. or Saturday, November 11th at 2 p.m. or at 7 p.m. The show has all its frights, fights, and more. Tickets are only $5 for students and $10 for adults and can be purchased on school cash online or at the door. Hi Knights, here are your Wheaton College visits for this week. Today we will have Mount St. Mary's University. On Thursday we will have St. John's University. On Friday we will have Marymount University. Please make sure to register on Naviance and stop by room 1003 to meet with our reps. Attention students interested in applying to Edison and other programs. The application is now open. Be sure to see your counselor if you need any assistance. All applications must be completed by this Friday, November 3rd. We in Creative Artists, you still have a lot of time to conjure some magic for our Wonderland theme for the literary magazine. Deadline is January 12th. You can earn up to 15 SSL hours, 5 per entry. Scan the QR code for more information and a submission form. Are you interested in business? You're in luck. DECA, a club aimed around preparing up upcoming leaders and entrepreneurs, has their meeting Tuesday during lunch. Come join us on Halloween in 3315. Hope to see you there. Happy Mental Health Awareness Week, we in high school. Join us in various activities that we have planned for you all this week. Today, let's talk about mental health. During homeroom, you will be given a handout where you'll be talking about who you are. Don't lose this handout. Also, during lunch, we'll have mental health resources outside room 1005. You will also receive friendship bracelets and Mandela coloring sheets will be given out. Let's walk it out on Wednesday. Since there is no school for students on Wednesday, take a moment and go for a mindfulness walk on Wednesday. Please share pictures about your walk to our Instagram account. On Thursday, we'll have trivia. Trivia questions about mental health will be on display. Students who come in and answer the questions correctly will earn a prize. Additionally, they will be given, they'll be eligible to enter for a raffle for more fun prizes. Questions will be based on information that will be given out during our resource fair on Tuesday. Lastly, on Friday, be who you are. You need to turn in a handout given to you during Renaissance on Tuesday. Also, Thursday's raffle prize winners will be announced during morning announcements. Winners will be able to pick up their prizes during lunch. Look forward to seeing all of our knights actively participating in our Mental Health Awareness Week activities. Students, come by the Wellness Center today during lunch or any Tuesday to participate in our mental health workshops. We will be talking about different topics such as self-care, trauma, resiliency, depression, and more. For more information, come to the Wellness Center, room 1117. Estudiantes, acércate al Centro del Bienstra los jueves durante el almuerzo para participar en nuestros talleres de salud mental. Estaremos hablando de diferentes temas como autosiodo, trauma y resiliencia, depresión y mucho más. MCPS and Montgomery County Schools Psychologist Association will be hosting free virtual and in-person events all this week. They will give students and families opportunities to hear from mental health experts on issues that are important to the community. Students who participate and complete the necessary forms can earn up to 10 SSL hours. Scan the QR code for more information. The Wellness Center is hosting an art therapy group after school on Thursday. This group will be beneficial for students looking to process difficult emotions through individual art making, while also receiving mutual support from peers. This group is open to both English and Spanish speakers. El Centro de Bienestar organiza un grupo de arte terapia después de las clases los jueves. 
Este grupo sería beneficio para los estudiantes que buscan procesar emociones difíciles y a través de las creaciones artísticas individuales y al mismo tiempo recibir apoyo mutuo de sus compañeros. Este grupo está abierto a hablantes de inglés y español. Signing off, Jesse L. And Heaven Work Crew. Thank <laughs> you.